we have over 10,000 people who've taken this, have near-term benefits within six weeks of they feel better, their mood is better, they're less anxious, uh, they're sleeping better. Hi, I'm Kerry Reichbach, the co-founder and current president of Gree Team. And today we're very fortunate to have Eric, who is the co-founder of Fatty 15 with us. Eric is a Navy physician, a veteran of three wars and an entrepreneur. So welcome to Gray Team. And we're very excited to learn more about your life, your history and what you're doing now. Oh, thank you, Carrie. I appreciate it. And being here is, is amazing. And your mission is amazing. We are a Navy technology. Uh, we're a military family and we're developing this technology to help veterans um, feel better. And so your mission and what you're doing is so important to us. Um, so I'm Eric and yes, a military physician for 25 years, uh, worked with the Navy and the Marine Corps, a lot of deployments, um, Iraq, Afghanistan, uh, East Africa, um, and some of the most entrepreneurial things I've ever done. Um, after I was able to use my GI Bill to get an MBA at Rady, which is oh, wow. a UCSD business school, great program, um, very much entrepreneurial focus. So if you have people who want to go there, get in touch with me, it's, it's a great program. Um, and so I was able to start a few companies with that background. And so one was a medical device company called Expand Ortho. Um, I worked for a digital health company where we were putting you know, real-time physician data uh, in their hands so they could make better decisions with regards to patient care. Um, I developed a company that was a, a therapeutic discovery company where we were working to treat um, diseases like uh, pulmonary fibrosis and NASH. And so today I'm focused on Fatty 15, which as you mentioned, um, is a natural, it's a supplement that is designed to improve the health and wellness of everyone, including veterans. So, as I understand, um, Fatty 15 was originally kind of isolated in the dolphin community and, and it kind of somehow uh, somebody bright, I'm assuming it was you or your lovely wife, figured out that if it works on dolphins, it would work on other mammals. Yes, that's, that's a perfect segue. That's exactly what happened, right? And so we found, really Stephanie found, um, this molecule because it was benefiting the health and wellness of the Navy's dolphins. Um, and so to make a long story short, it's a TED talk. And so feel free to watch that. But the Navy has had a population of dolphins for 60 years, and they have been taking care of them incredibly well. This population leaves, they live in San Diego Bay, they go out in the open ocean and they come back every day because it's their home, it's where they wanna be. And so the Navy has taken such good care of them that they live 50% longer than those in the wild. It's like the ultimate longevity zone for dolphins, right? And so because of that, they have a geriatric dolphin program. So dolphins, as they age, get the same diseases that people do. Pre-diabetes, um, NAFL, NASH, you know, which are liver diseases, um, and even the full suite of Alzheimer's disease. So Stephanie, my wife, developed or she created the uh, Navy's translational medicine program 20 years ago to see if those discoveries that were being made in this really healthy dolphin population and why they were living so long could be translated to the same in humans. And so to make a long story short and fast forward, she found using um, the samples that had been collected over the last 60 years and leveraging like multi-omics, metabolomics, lipidomics, genomics, fancy technology, she was able to find over a hundred molecules that looks like they predicted which dolphins were the healthiest and which weren't. And so one of those molecules was C15. And so, as you mentioned, C15 was dolphin born. Since that time, we've studied it in a variety of ways over four years, published our findings in, in nature and others. And we came out with a supplement called Fatty 15, which is you know, based on this technology. Uh, Navy technology, which is the first uh, essential fatty acid to be discovered in 90 years. Uh, that's absolutely amazing. I mean, you know, everyone talks about omega-3s and, you know, having a ratio of omega-6. Right. But from my understanding, and please correct me if I'm 
way off target here. Fatty 15 is actually more effective mm. than omega 3s. And, you know, we push omega 3s, right. and every bit of literature, everyone is saying, you know, omega 3s are heart healthy and, and the lower cholesterol and blood pressure. But, but fatty 15 is actually better. Right. So, we, when we discovered C15 as an essential fatty acid, we had the same question. There's only two others. One's an omega-3, one's an omega-6, and now C15. So we naturally said, is it better? And so we compared C15 with fatty 15, which is pure C15. Um, you know, it's a vegan-friendly, uh, sustainably produced, you know, 100% pure, basically, supplement. So we compared that against the highest bar, uh, omega-3, which is EPA. Right. Pure, pure EPA, EPA, something you can't get in fish oil supplements. Right. right? And so we compared them. Um, and we found that, yes, uh, C15 was better, broader, and safer, meaning it had more clinically relevant like benefits for cell systems, uh, heart, lung, liver cells, um, than the pure EPA. And we also found it was Amazing. less, it was safer. So at the highest doses, pure EPA was toxic to some of these cells, whereas fatty 15 was not. So that was, it was interesting because that was our first question. Is it better? And yes, for cellular benefits, it is better. Our next question was, okay, if it is for a central fatty acid, and if it is three times better than omega-3s, it should have some pretty incredible metabolites. Our body should make it into other molecules that have benefit. So then we started to look through the metabolites, and we're still looking. But we found one of the metabolites is called pentadecanoyl carnitine. We'll just say PDC, which turns out to be the second ever discovered fully acting endocannabinoid. And so endocannabinoids are the, the holy grail of health, right? All the they rage regulate, now. right? Yep. Everything, you know, with our mind, our pain, our inflammation, you know, pretty much everything. And so fatty 15 is great because when you take the supplement, you're getting the third ever discovered essential fatty acid, and you're getting the second ever discovered fully acting endocannabinoid. It's like two for one. So I got to say this, we're, we're very excited about this for a number of reasons. One, just the scientific community. We're always looking to help and expand. But uh, Eric has been uh, instrumental in supplying Fatty 15 to our veterans here at Gray Team uh, at absolutely no cost. And we are having their blood work done pre and intermediate and post so we are actually proving every single thing that he's saying. And I got to tell you, if it works on combat veterans who have a multitude of issues that the average civilian does not have, then what it'll do for the world is just absolutely amazing. Yeah, so first off, I want to thank you for for helping. Uh, obviously, you're still in the military, so mm -hmm. it's very important that your brothers and sisters are as healthy as possible. But uh, it's even more important that that you're continuing to research this and find more and more elements that, that this will progress the the human wellness right. beyond what we typically thought we were capable of. Um, it's just it's it's incredible Navy technology to help dolphins, and <laughs> and we're we're really impressed by everything you're doing. Yeah. Um, so what do you see as the next look, you're, yeah. you're, you're a Navy veteran, you, you're a very successful entrepreneur. What's next for Eric? For, for me? Yeah, that's a good question. We'll see. Um, and so you mentioned a few things. And so we're, you know, the relationship we have is incredible because Navy technology helping veterans, giving back to veterans and what you're doing is a big part of our mission. So what we see um, in people taking this, the long-term benefits is really why we created it, right? Which is benefits to your heart, lung, you know, liver health. Um, but the way we see that, the way the veterans will see that is through their labs. So we're getting pre and post CBC chemistries, lipid panel, liver enzymes to see if we can see improvements in those factors in those mm -hmm. labs as well. Um, and then 
you know, interestingly, when we studied this in dolphins at first, you know, the healthiest dolphins had highest levels of C15, right? They couldn't tell us if they were having, if they were feeling better. You know, ee, ee. it's hard to, it's hard to say. Uh, well, that was, say that was good. good. I, I remember that from the flipper show. Yeah. And so once we started getting this in people, it was amazing. Two thirds of people, we have over 10,000 people who've taken this, have near term benefits within six weeks of they feel better. Their mood is better. They're less anxious. Uh, they're sleeping better. We also have a lot of people sending us pictures of their hair and skin because it's a fatty acid. You know, if people's hairs are generally thicker after they take it, the skin's better as well. So that near-term benefits that we're receiving is is amazing to see. And is when people send us things, it's it's really it's it's great because we're you know improving their health as well as the veterans' health, and it's 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 why we're doing this. And so, what's next? You know, we we want to get this discovery out to the world. And we started doing that through publications in Nature and Public Library of Science on the science side um, and working with organizations like you to get the message out to, you know, the non-science community, veterans and everyone. So it's an awareness of C15. Um, and then we want to have this as an ingredient, right? So we created a, you know, like I mentioned, 100% pure, sustainable, vegan-friendly, award-winning ingredient that would be wonderful in a bar sent to Africa. It would be great in Wheaties. Uh, it would be a good food fortifier to pretty much every place omega-3s are. And since it's not an oil, it doesn't oxidize. It's very stable. It can be sent to a variety of environments. So it would be incredible for this to come out to the world to improve global health as a food ingredient that is in just our food supply. And then if the USRDA would put, you know, the amount of C15 uh, recommended, you know, on the back of a nutrition label, that would be outstanding as well. So where we're focused now is on the ingredient side as well and finding a good place for how to bring the ingredient out to the world. Very, very cool. I, I think that, you know, our our viewers are are probably pretty excited about, you know, maybe, maybe implementing this into, you know, their routines, their protocols that they do every morning. Tell us a little bit about the dosing. <clears throat> the dosing is interesting because, you know, we a variety, we did a variety of studies to show that 100 milligrams is generally what people need to raise their C15 to therapeutic levels, right? And so, but, you know, you can take, we did safety studies of much higher than that. So, for instance, if I take, I mean, I've been taking C15 for a while, fatty 15, if I take 100 milligrams, I feel um, better mood, I'm less anxious. In fact, if I don't take it, Stephanie, my wife, will put it in front of me. So, so she reminds me to take it. If I take two of those, then I get, I feel less hungry. I don't eat as much. And so I get different benefits depending on, you know, how much I eat, how much I take. And so hundred milligrams is what we recommended. You can't take more than that uh, for near-term benefits. And, and hundred milligrams is, is one yeah, capsule. Yeah, it's a very small <clears throat> capsule. And so in that capsule, unlike a lot of supplements, it's got nothing else in it. There's no fillers, there's no flour, there's nothing else. It is pure C15. So that's why we're able to use a size two capsule, which is really small. So compared to omega-3s, which you need a couple very large oily capsules, sure. this, is, this is very small. And you can break it open, put it in your coffee or things like that, which is makes it easy. So I think this is great news for everyone. And there's no reason why anyone shouldn't be trying this right now. And that brings me to, I guess, my next point. If if our audience wanted to purchase uh, Fatty 15, C15, is there uh, is there a, a website? I, I know that it's not available in stores yet, but I'm sure a lot of our audience is very interested in getting it now. Yeah. Um, where where would they get it? Right. And so they could get it on our website, which is www.fatty15.com. Um, and then we're also working on incorporating our own veterans program into that website. So if there are people who are veterans, uh, military personnel, um, and first responders, reach out to us at info at fatty15.com and we'll um, put you in our veterans program with discounts. Additionally, on your site, um, you have a link to purchasing Fatty 15 as well. Oh, that's, that's absolutely true. Uh, we're launching a brand new site for all of you who are interested in the latest technologies and supplements to increase the human health span, lifespan, wellness span. 
That is going to be on the Great Team website. It's going to be our CyberFit program. And you can get involved in that and be one of the very first to try out all of our new stuff. And I have to say that when you do purchase anything through our website, you are not only supporting new science and new technology, but you're also supporting Great Team because a portion of all of those purchases will be kicked back to Gray Team to continue our life-saving operations. All right, I have a question for you. Okay. You know, um, you're very active. You're still in the military. You have to pass height and weight and 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 certain physical fitness tests. You know, at Gray Team, we're all about performance and staying healthy and, and physically fit. Is there something that C15 will do to actually elevate strength, endurance, wellness, things like that. Yeah, I still have to pass a PRT, sometimes a PFT. So yes, I, I need to stay in shape and it's harder to do as I age. I'm 50 years old now, so it's a lot more difficult than it was uh, when I was younger, uh, but still an important part of my life. Um, and I I have a program of weightlifting and and some extra aerobic exercise, mountain biking and, and running, things like that. I wish I could do it more, um, but those are the things I do. Uh, with regards to C15, it's interesting. C15 works in a variety of ways. One, one is that it's a super sturdy um, fatty acid and it gets incorporated into our cells. So our cells don't break down as quickly. So we call that reverse cellular aging, but it basically means that the cell membranes are, more, are less likely to pop. Okay. And so that's one mechanism. The other mechanism is it improves and repairs mitochondria. So remember, mitochondria are the powerhouses of, of our cells. Right? So. And so if we lose those, we lose energy. And so this actually helps repair your mitochondria. And so the last mechanism I'll mention for C15 specifically is it, it um, activates PPAR receptors. PPAR receptors are known as the orchestrators of, of our metabolism. They're the ones that are responsible for our mood, our sleep, our appetite, um, and, and immunity. And so all those mechanisms for sure help with the ability of C15 to help you with you know, energy, mitochondria-related energy, mm -hmm. and endurance as well. And then you know, for me, um, when I feel better, I tend to work out better. Of course. And so, you know, I, I sometimes take Fatty 15 pre-workout and I believe that helps as well. Is that is that an additional dosage or yeah. uh, is that your regular dosage and you just take it later in the day? Yeah. So I I tend to take one in the morning and then if I need another, I take it, you know, throughout when, when I feel I need it throughout the day. So if I work out, sometimes it's before the workout. If there's something where I'm not sleeping well, I might take one before I go to bed. So I, you know, I adjust the dosing based on you know, when I feel I need it after I'm getting the baseline of C15. So, you know, what we're finding is that a theory now is that a decrease in C15 levels in our society, because we drink less whole fat milk, because we have now plant-based milk alternatives that have no C15, that lack of C15 is driving like diseases of, mm -hmm. you know, diabetes and, you know, liver diseases and metabolic syndrome and things like that. And we're studying that as well. Um, but so if you, imp if you increase your C15 levels with the hundred milligrams dose, you would combat a deficiency in C15. So you would get your levels to the point where they'd be normal for you. And then you could use the another hundred milligrams if you needed it for those near term benefits. Well, we're going to put that to the test because uh, we are going to run Eric through some great team training protocols, oh, no. which should be very exciting. Um, if you've gotten this far into the podcast, I just want to thank you for your attention. As always, uh, we are here for you. We would love to hear from you. If you have anything specific that you would like to ask about C15 or anything else, as always, reach out to us. Again, thanks for your attention. Thanks for your support. And we'll see you soon. Thank you. Thank you. Gary.